Good morning, children. Praise the Lord. We meet again today. Stay happy and healthy in this new day. And before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's word this morning. And today, let's continue our adventure to know God's creation from God's amazing grace and book. And this morning, we will learn from Nature Nugget about flowers. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer? Thank you, Lord, for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your words. May your Holy Spirit be within us to lead us and bless us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Proverbs chapter 20, verse 11. It says, Even a child is known by his actions by whether his conduct is pure and right. Children, I know of a family of flowers that grow in many different places. They grow in the shaded woods. They grow in bright, sunny meadows and in damp marshes. They'll even grow in your yard. Their little flowers come in many different shapes and sizes. Some are purple, some are yellow and purple, but all of them are violets. One thing that all the different kinds of violets have in common is that each small flower has a tiny door guarded by parts of the flower. In order to get to the flower's sweet tasting nectar, insects have to pull their tongue through the little door. And believe it or not, only the bugs that help the violet can get their tongues through the door. This little door keeps insects such as ants from getting in and stealing all of the nectar. The door also brushes bugs that do get through with pollen. Then, when the bugs leave, they take the pollen with them to other flowers. The violet's door guards its precious nectar. Children, you and I should guard the door of our heart. With Jesus' help, you can protect your heart and your mind only letting in the good, helpful things and keeping out the bad. Today, decide to be like a violet. Shut your heart's door to the devil and to the bad things he wants to bring into your life. This is the end of our morning worship. And today, we learn from one of God's beautiful and amazing graces, violet. Violet flowers are unique because each little flower has a kind of small door that is used to protect the violet from outside disturbances. Children, as violets always guard the door, we must also be able to take care of ourselves, especially the door of our hearts, because around you, there are so many things that tempt you to do bad things, fighting against parents, being a lazy child, and many other negative things. Therefore, ask Jesus to help you guard your heart and mind to be able to say no to every temptation that comes your way. May today, with God's help, you will fill your heart and mind with all the good and true things. May the Lord bless and protect all of the children on this wonderful day. Amen.